Hello, masterminds. I'm so exhausted. Still. I woke up from a nap. Because, uh, you know, I'm getting five hours of sleep and then waking up early to upload, edit, etc. But I guess I can think after getting a, some sleep in. Yeah. Isms. The judicial system of this country is too soft on criminals. I mean, you can still care for human interests and uh, try to minimize the negative effects you, uh, we, 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 we dish out. The pleasures of the senses are the highest good. The pleasures of the senses. The pleasures of the senses. Highest good. Uh, no. They're dead. We need tough leaders who can silence the troublemakers and the traditional, <laughs> traditional values. Ooh. Worldly possessions are the greatest good and the highest value in life. Mm. I slightly agree with that. I kind of look at that as... You can rise, rise, but only so high before you reach a dip. It is best to live simply and in a natural environment. Yeah. Sadly, we can't do that. I just had a brain fart, I'm sorry. <laughs> Knowledge. Here in my garage. I will survive. I slightly agree, because... We should care about... The interests of our species. <laughs> Which means we can also care about, you know everything else that our species relies on. What? Nope. Yeah. Mm. I don't agree with the word believe. It's fact. Death penalty is a punishment for crimes. <coughs> uh, am I getting sick? Death penalty. Is that cruel and unusual? There's only a very limited case where I would approve of it being used. But then the fact that the justice system is so broken, putting people to death for crimes that just don't warrant that level of punishment. Conscious life. 
<laughs> There's only one race, the human race. People just want to make your ethnic background, your skin color, a way to differentiate so you can divide and conquer. I should meditate. <sighs> I agree slightly because uh, we need societal measures to redistribute the wealth. They gotta keep a majority of it. Majority of the wealth at that given time before taxes are taken. <laughs> It is good to defy traditional family values as feminists and homosexuals have done. <laughs> Foreigners and immigrants have a beneficial effect on our society. Yes. Free market capitalism leads to gross inequalities in income and wealth, which is a great social evil. Yes. But it's not just free market capitalism. It's just capitalism. It needs socialism to be saved. That's what FDR did. He saved capitalism from itself. Ugh. It's a failed system. No. No, there's a point to it. A good one at that. Tradition-oriented religiousness. The alpha factor. Reflects adherence to traditional standards of morality and resistance to change in social structure. Unmitigated self-interest. The beta factor. Reflects a competitive worldview where the goal of a person is to do as best for themselves as possible and the groups that they belong to. With the expectation that this will come at the expense of someone else. We're all interconnected. Communal rationalism. The gamma factor. Reflects an optimistic view of human nature and society. Individuals who score in high communal rationalism tend to believe that democracy works well. The delta factor. Reflects spiritual beliefs outside of organized religion. The epsilon factor. Egalitarianism. Reflects a commitment to... This fact about inequality must be caused by some sort of oppression. Hmm. Interesting. It's 8.08 p.m. Circuits is likely playing at 1, 2, 3, 4, go. Teenage faces will be on in like an hour. But I'm tired. So tired. Masterminds, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next vlog when I'm rested. Remember, be smart for your heart. Good night.